avoiding these five mistakes can help save your business money on their commercial auto insurance premiums and help avoid any unnecessary gaps in coverage. Hey everybody, my name's Patrick McBride. I'm the founder and the agency owner here at the McBride Agency. And if you or your employees use vehicles in any way, shape or form for business purposes, whether it's just one car for deliveries or a whole fleet on the road, it's crucial to have the right kind of auto insurance. I mean, really, who wouldn't want protection for their goods and company finances from a service they pay for, right? Now, you and I both know that auto insurance is mandatory in Illinois, and frankly, it's required in all but one state in the US. But it's important to remember that a vehicle used for business operations needs commercial insurance policies. Now, that's why today I want to share with you five of the most common mistakes people make when buying a commercial policy. Uh, by avoiding these mistakes, you can save yourself from costly problems down the road. See what I did there? Now, mistake number one is focusing exclusively on cost. This is the most common and probably fatal mistake people make when purchasing any insurance. The cost should never be your only deciding factor when signing a contract with an insurance company. And that's what a policy is. It's a contract, right? I mean, I'm sure the value of premiums, they do change from carrier to carrier, but a cheap policy is oftentimes just that, it's cheap. There's most likely a reason behind the dramatic savings with coverage pitfalls that can cost you more in the long run. That's why it's important to know exactly what you're getting in any new quote. What are the liability limits that are offered? What coverage endorsements are included? The amount of your deductibles? What other types of assistance are being offered are all questions you need to ask. Mistake number two is cutting back on those liability limits, right? Car accidents can lead to costly damages and expensive losses. If your company's liability limits only cover the state minimums, the rest of the coverages will be on you. And state minimums in Illinois are ridiculously low. Mistake number three, not reviewing your policy before renewal. Now, it's crucial to review your policy at every renewal. Rates change, new processes and products come into the market, and your coverage may no longer align with your needs. Now, I am part of the few on this, but I believe that talking to your insurance agent, uh, I would love for that to be us, by the way, is the best way to make sure your coverage is still up to your expectations. And I don't want you paying too much or protecting yourself too little. Now, mistake number four is not getting adequate coverage for mobile equipment. Mobile equipment can be a little tricky to understand because in a lot of cases, it's actually covered by your general liability policy or inland marine coverages. However, you may need the liability uh, from the auto in other situations. Now, examples on that would be if the equipment is being used in the workplace, your general liability or inland marine coverage will likely cover any incident. But if that equipment's in transit or if it's permanently attached to the vehicle and an accident occurs, the auto policy will likely take over on that side. This protection is a must for anyone with mobile equipment that travels on public roads. Mistake number five, and finally here, right, is not having non-owned auto coverage. Not having non-owned auto coverage can be a huge mistake for your business because it's exposing you to extra risk in the event of an accident of an employee driving their own car, but it was used inside some sort of business operation or for business purposes. Let's take the example of you have an employee that was driving their own car and they got into an accident visiting a client or a job site and their policy does not cover all of the costs associated with that accident. Your business is now gonna be held liable and you could be paying those costs out of pocket. Having non-owned auto coverage helps protect your business and you from these types of financial risks. Ensuring you have adequate coverage in the event of an accident involving any employee-owned vehicle. Now, it is important to note here that non-owned auto coverage is not required by law, but still it's a great risk management strategy for any business that may ask or require their employees to use their own vehicles at any time for business purposes. Now, here at the McBride Agency, our top priority is you. It's protecting you against unexpected losses and threats. So whether you're just starting out with a new business, or you're an established business owner, reach out to us. Let's start a conversation about how we can help protect you and your business. You can call or text us at 815-456-5006. We will help you find the right coverage for your needs. Or use the links in the description. No matter what you do, take action today. I truly look forward to the opportunity to work with you and connecting you with our team of risk management and commercial insurance experts. We're actually cheering for you, even if you're not currently a client of the McBride Agency.